Hey guys, don't worry, I haven't forgotten about you or anything like that. I've just been really busy for the last month or so to build up the the podcast that I've been working on that I've been mentioning earlier. And this is actually what this video is about. Because over the last, actually since I started making these videos, I have been asked by other new starter up video makers to ask if I would like to do shout outs for them and stuff like that. And to be honest, I'm not a huge fan of that. Not that I I don't want to to help out other video makers because I do. I want to back up uh, the community and all that. But let me give you an example. I was watching a video maker. I was actually following his channel for a while. Then suddenly in a video, he burps. Now, I know that some people might find that funny, and that's okay. I don't, to be honest. When you're making stuff like videos, you are taking away time from them that they could play the game. And in my opinion, when you burp, for example, or stuff like that in a video, it is about the same thing as basically burping them up in their head. And it kind of pissed me off, and I haven't watched a single video from this video maker since, because it pissed me off so much. And for all you new video sub makers out there, I don't have any control of what you're doing, and because of this, I'm not really into the idea of promoting a channel, at least not until I know you a little bit better. Now, some of you new video makers that I have been following and have been writing me, I do watch your videos, I do follow what you're doing, So this is definitely a way for me to get to know you. And then one day I would probably definitely be interested in doing a shout out. But this is also a video that you would probably hopefully find very interesting. Because as you know, I am working on making a podcast together with a community website. Now, there is a lot of stuff that needs to be done. We have talked a lot about the format in the beginning. We talked about using YouTube. Now we're actually starting to get a little bit more into the idea of maybe using iTunes instead, because we're not sure we can create an account on YouTube where we can start with posting videos more than 15 minutes. Even when you're starting a new account today, you don't even have access to 15 minutes. You only have access to 10 minutes until you have released a certain amount of videos and until you have reached a certain amount of viewers and subscribers. And at that point, you do get access to 15 minutes. But in order to make videos longer than 15 minutes, you need to be partnered with them. And we're hoping that it is possible for non-private customers or whatever you'd like to call it. I mean, that someone like me that is a private person that makes videos that I can't start to do videos more than 15 minutes, that's okay. But as a community website, we would need to be able to do longer videos. And if that is not possible to do on YouTube, we're gonna have to find another media to post what we wanna create. So this is why it might end up being iTunes we're gonna do it on instead. So this is something that we're checking out right now. Of course, there's a lot of work that needs to be done. This is far from finished, but I'm going to talk a little bit about it in this video because we are in need of people that are interested in being a part of this. And this is where you as video makers that have written me over the past, well, I guess a year or so, this is where you can write me, say, hey, I'm willing to do anything or do something. I'm really into the idea. What can I do to help? Well, so far, we are looking for a couple of contributors. We want to, at least as much as possible, to make it into video format. Of course, my background is in video making, so this is why I am more interested in in making it a visual rather than just audio podcast. So right from the beginning, I mentioned that I'm not that into the idea of having a camera in my face, but to be honest, I have been thinking about it a lot and I tend to be a little bit more into the idea today of actually having it so that me and my co-presenters or co-hosts that we can see each other and that you can see us while we're talking about what's going on with WOW. 
Now where you as contributors come into place, first of all, I am in need of co-hosts. The guy that I've been working with, well, he might end up being a co-host, but there might be a problem with some wife aggro and taking care of the website takes a lot of time. So that might not be a possibility. He might be able to guest star once in a while, but actually having him being a regular part might not be possible. So if you have some type of, maybe you got some amateur radio background or that was nice. That was my computer's antivirus telling me that it's been updated. Anyway, if you have some, maybe you have some, some, um, oh, I lost my, my, that, boing, it lost my, I lost my thread. But maybe you have some experience in some amateur radio stuff, or maybe you're just good at talking. That can easily be something that can be useful, and you're not necessarily afraid of talking to strangers and knowing that there might be thousands of people watching you at one point. That is definitely something that can be used. And to be honest, I think it could be kind of cool if it were both a man and a woman to have both have the, of course, me having the male perspective of the game and maybe another guy and also having a woman's perspective. I think that could be interesting. I have watched a couple of podcasts where at least one of the presenters have been women and that can tend to make some interesting discussions and such once in a while. So that could be cool. So if you do have some interest in this or maybe think that this is something that you could do, well, write me an email. Tell me a little bit about yourself. And maybe if you have a chance of doing some audio recording where you tell a little bit about yourself and just throw it up on YouTube, you can make it hidden, hidden if you don't want all your friends to see it. And that way... You could send it to me and I could see it or listen to it and I could get a little bit of an idea of where you're at. Now, we're also going to need segments during the podcasts. That could be stuff like lore. I mean, there's there's enough of lore to easily fill up tons of shows. And this is potentially something that's going to be made and created once a week. So you have to think when it comes to contributing to something visual to this podcast, it's not something that, okay, I can make a video series of like five episodes. You're going to have to be able to do stuff that can potentially run for a long time. Now, you might be thinking, ah, I can do something about add-ons. Well, I guess you could, but it's just not quite enough. It's a little bit too easy. You're going to have to put a little bit more work into stuff like that. Now, we will probably have someone that is good to finding small, fun little things. That's the person that could do stuff like add-ons. But he could one week do something about add-ons and then second week do something about some fun quests or stuff like that. You know, sort of like a, well, I don't want to call it a scrap box, but you know what? It's, it's, it's kind of like that stuff and fun stuff you can do in the game. It's sort of like the things that is put into a box and put under your bed and you pick it out once in a while to check and look inside it. This is something that I would like. This could be a a fun way to sort of end it. And this is where, and this is stuff where add-ons can be put into the podcast. But otherwise, like I mentioned, stuff like lore, I would kind of like to have a little bit of maybe someone looking a little bit about blue posts, talking a little bit about it, maybe showing a couple of of screenshots of some of the interesting threads that are on the forums. But other than that, well, do you have a great idea? That's basically what we're asking people to come up with. If you are supposed to do a segment on this show where you have a potential of getting out to a huge audience have the potential of getting a lot of subscribers well come let me know give me an idea of what you would like to do maybe even let's say we're gonna run through the month of february to give you a chance of finding some ideas maybe trying to make a kind of the segment that would you would like to do on the show we are going to put 
out a and create sort of a pilot episode where we're going to try it out. That episode will be posted on different channels, maybe even your channel on YouTube. And we will try to get it out as many places as possible and get feedback on what do people like, what people, what do people not like? Do we need to do something different? How do we want to put it together? So this is probably where your segment would get in. Now, one thing that I just need to say, point out right now is in your own segments, you don't need to do any of when you're done. Oh, go check out my channel. We're going to make sure to do that for you. So after uh, your segment is in and it's been shown, we're going to say, oh, thanks again for hoodly who go check out his channel is cool. And the segments we're going to give you about two to three minutes. This, of course, can be changed if something needs to be a little longer on a specific episode or uh, sometimes something you want to mention in a specific episode is not that long. Well, then it can be shorter, but try thinking. A thumb rule is we are going to play on a segment time of about two to three minutes. So sit down, think long and hard about what you would like to do. Try to put something together. Put it up on YouTube channel. If you have a great idea, but you're not a video maker yourself, well, then write me and then maybe we can get you in touch with a video maker and you can work together to create a segment. This is definitely something that is useful. So maybe if you are a video maker and you don't really have a great idea, well, then write me anyways, because if someone has a great idea for something or we get an idea, we would like to do this. We could contact you and say, hey, we have this idea. Would you like to try and do something with this? Or like I said, if someone has a great idea, but he doesn't or she doesn't have the know-how or interest in doing the videos yourself, you can sit down and we can get you together to create this segment. So even if you don't have an idea, write me and I'm going to make sure to do whatever I can to bring people together so that we can all make a great podcast together. So send me an email and create whatever you need and put it up on your channel and we'll see what we can use. And I think that's just about it for me for this time. I do have some news regarding the raid team and I'm going to hopefully make a video about where I'm talking a little bit more about that in the near future. But Keep a look at on the channel. I'm going to let you know what's going on with the podcast. And if you want to contact me for whatever, the email you can write to should have been on the screen the entire video. So it shouldn't be that difficult to, to find it and write me. So let me know whatever you would like to say. And I think that's everything. Am I right? Yeah, I think so. So I could just... I think all that's left to say is see ya.